Girls, if I told you there was a guy out there that was a protector, provider, and he was just this drop dead, six pack ab stud of a guy, long flowing hair, okay, and uh, beautiful and righteous in every way, and strong, a warrior, and tender, and gentle, and not self-obsessed. He can't put weight on if he tried. (laughs) And he doesn't try because he's so busy loving you and writing you poems. (laughs) And all he wants to do is hold your hand and have long, meaningful conversations. And when he goes through the five love languages and you say physical touch is your love language, he doesn't think awesome. He doesn't think sex. He thinks tenderness and rubbing your back. And if it leads to something that night, that's fine with him, but he doesn't want to push you. Okay. That guy. Okay. You're like, where's that guy? I'm, I'm, I'm not going to date anybody else. I want to know him more. I will adjust or refocus every relationship or activity that I currently have in order that I might be closer to him. I will evaluate everything else that comes into my life by asking myself, will it draw me closer to Fabio meets St. Francis? And, uh, and, and, and I'll stop right there. Okay, this is Jesus. This is, this is what Peter and the gospel writers are saying. This is your Jesus. And so if you know him, you'll love him. And all you'll want to do is, how do I know more of you? 